Hello everyone. The topic today, again, is the loss of muscle mass with aging and its impact on the capacity to generate force. From a functional point of view, the elderly largely depends on muscle to move and carry objects, which is essentially determined by the capacity of muscles to produce force. So this study published in the Journal of Gerontology in 2006, looked at the impact of aging on both muscle mass and strength. The graph shows the muscle mass, which is depicted in gray, reduces in both men and women with aging. However, the loss of muscle mass is higher in men than women. But another very important thing is that the reduction in muscle strength, which is in black, is approximately three-fold higher than the reduction in muscle mass in both sexes. This obviously demonstrates that muscle mass is important, but it's not the main determinant of muscle strength. Multiple factors, such as age-related neurological changes, the hormonal and metabolic milieu, pro-inflammatory cytokines, and perhaps fat infiltration that we normally call lipotoxicity, may contribute to progressive muscle weakness in older adults. Finally, this last study, published in the Journal of Clinical Endocrinology and Metabolism in 2004, looked at the accumulation of fat in muscle and liver with aging. It clearly shows that in both organs, fat accumulation was significantly higher in the elderly in comparison to young subjects. This was also associated with impaired glycemic control, as demonstrated by higher plasma glucose and insulin levels during a neural glucose tolerance test. In conclusion, aging-related loss of muscle mass and strength as well as deterioration of muscle quality leads to multiple dysfunction alteration and also impaired mobility. The good news is that strength and endurance exercise can improve these conditions. Importantly, from a functional perspective, muscle strength is crucial and it can be significantly improved even if muscle mass does not proportionally increase with resistance training. So as usual, the message is get moving so muscles do not shrink as we age. So to finalize this video, I'm giving you some footage that supports the discourse. In other words, it's not just what I say, but also what we have to do. So all the best, and I'll see you in the next. Bye for now.